you mentioned the Wesley Ward runners because you'd be wanting to follow them because they're normally up on the front end as we just see the best thing symbolised is now oh, the clear is... favourite. Oh. We're not seeing it on our screen, but there is a loose horse broken through the front of the stalls. Who's this? This is number 13, Show Me, Show Me. They managed to break through the front of the stalls and is now galloping all on her own down to, down to the grandstand. Let's find out what happened with Luke. Paddy Mather's just coming out. Paddy, you OK? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm just what, fine. Just, just, what he just got a little bit agitated and then he just jumped, jumped backwards and he's just jumped in straight into the front of the gates and they've just sprung open. He was, um, he was getting impatient before. And... Yeah, look, he was fourth one in. Um, it's two year olds. There's a lot on there you can see he's getting really upset, so no, I'm just getting disappointed. You seem calm, I'm a nervous wreck. Well done, I'm glad you're okay. Just disappointed. Disappointing, of course, because the horse cannot come back and take his place. So, had been in for a while. The handler wasn't oh. long out of the way. This horse got impatient. The stalls are closed on the front by a little latch, aren't they, Jess? But they can, can obviously break through. Yeah, there is a latch over there, but there's a certain amount of pressure that will force that stall open. And no surprise there that Paddy is absolutely gutted there. You're all primed, ready. Show me, show me. Happened to win the Brocklesby, so the the first juvenile contest of the year over here. But I wanted to that are run on the all-weather and um, that's just how and I just popped into some of the owners from the Onto Winner Partnership and they were really excited about seeing this horse in action. As it just ducks and swerves, the people trying to catch it there is rather enjoying the time cruising around. But it's important that he gets caught and taken Ah, yeah, but I know it's probably where it came out, so it's probably back here now. There's a few people there that let, let off the horses, so it'll be great, good if we can catch because if he runs back up the track, it's going, oh, there she goes, she's gone back up to the track. She'd probably run back up to the horses because they like being in the herd, you know, and she's... It's going, it's going to be... <laughs> Bit of a delay here yeah, now, you know. A delay for sure. Show me, show me. Heads his way back down the track. I'm surprised we haven't heard a big cheer from the crowd, but I'm sure Show me, show me is enjoying all this attention. But will he be heading all the way back? Do you think? Yeah, I think, I think he'll go quite a way down before he sees the stalls, then probably stop again. So it's a little bit of worry. Luke is down at the start, though. Yeah, I think the loose horse, I just heard someone say that's coming back down the track. Obviously, as, as Paddy was telling us earlier on, if you're in early, you are at a disadvantage. But as you can see over here, there's Oshin Murphy. He was in early on illusionist, uh, illusionist and um, they took that horse out. Now, so obviously, no, they can't start loading these horses until the loose horse has been caught, obviously, for on safety grounds. But... Um, it's uh, it's so frustrating. Just when you're talking to Paddy, you know, these jockeys. This is not only a big occasion for the for the owners and trainers, but for for the jockeys as well. And just the Oshi just leading his horse around, trying to keep the horse as calm as possible. Uh, we might see if we can grab a word when he comes around next time. But um, that's always the, the the danger when you do go in early, that you don't get a you don't get a fair crack of it. But as I said, there's a pretty way. Just getting a bit. Bit buzzy, Osh. Yeah, he's fine. He's fine. Yeah, these horses broke out. You got a bit excited. Cheers, well done. Anyway, show me, show me. Is thinking I've done my running. I'm going to have a little bit of a, a nibble, managing to avoid anyone catching him. Hopefully, it won't be too long. They've asked the crowd to be quiet so that they don't rev up the horse. So some, someone can just approach quietly. And there we go. Has been caught safely. Will be led back to the stables, and hopefully. The action can be underway shortly as they'll keep loading the other horses. As if you're a jockey down at the start, this horse has broken through the, through the stalls, has created even more of a delay. How much of an inconvenience is it? It's a bit of a nightmare because everybody was nearly in. There was only two or three, you know, left to go in. So everybody's getting ready, getting revved up to go. And it only takes, you know, one, one something to kick the back that makes yours charge to the front. And it's only two-year-olds. They haven't had many races. So it's they're all learning. And as I said, it's just one of those things that happen. It, Bad timing.